Hey, this is Dr. Tasha Rogers back again with herpes part four. So we talked about the symptoms and, you know, what you're going to see and when you're going to see it. I just want to briefly go over medications because it is very, very brief. Um, people tend to think that if you have been diagnosed with herpes that you need to be on medications and that is not necessarily true. We say that one to two outbreaks a year is acceptable, but if you're not having outbreaks, let me say it again. If you're not having outbreaks, please don't be pressed to be on the medication. Now, the medication only does one thing. It decreases how frequently you have outbreaks. That's all it really does. So if you're not having outbreaks, please, please don't use common sense with medical sense because they don't line up. And don't say, well, if I'm not having any outbreaks, if I take the medicine, then I won't ever have any outbreaks. That is not true. Anything a medicine treats, it can trigger. Let me say it again. Anything it treats, it can trigger. So I have plenty of patients who will say, I wasn't having outbreaks until I started taking the medicine. Now I'm having outbreaks. What can I do? Take the medicine. So if it's not bothering you, if you would have never known you had herpes, if you weren't told, if you are not having frequent outbreaks, no need for medicine.